our top story tonight. The underground crime wave continues to spread, with reports of angels in Peru, Madagascar, North Korea and Jamaica. Police forces across the world are baffled, adding their consternation to the confusion of top criminologists, theists and scientists alike. Disappearances are on the rise, the rate of violent deaths is at an all-time high and the government officials have nothing new to say. The British public can rest assured that we are doing everything we can to crack down on the perpetrators of these crimes. We've made over a thousand arrests in the London area alone. And we ask for your continued cooperation in this time of need. If you see anything suspicious, we urge you to call our information hotline on 080 -81 we are also working closely with foreign governments to put an end to this international crime wave. But will that be enough? Experts warn of a worldwide pandemic of revenge crimes and vigilantism. Police have stressed the importance of leaving peacekeeping to the professionals and of calling the emergency services only in the case of a genuine emergency. One thing is certain, this can't go on forever. Perhaps the Christmas spirit will convince the angels, whoever they may be, to rethink their strategy of fear and terror. Let's hope that the season of goodwill wins them over. Back to you, Clive.